Hi everyone, it's Miss Sam and it's time for another unboxing video. Um, I am sneaking this one in uh, during a thunderstorm while nobody is here, so the second people come in I will definitely put my mask back up. Um, but until then, just so that you can hear me a little bit better, I'm going to leave it down. Um, and I'm in a space where there's nobody near me, so I feel okay about this. Um, so let's get this book unboxing started. Oh, what's happening? All right, what have we got today? We have a second copy of Cardboard Kingdom, this year's main student book award winner. Um, so that's exciting. Uh, we've got Who Was Marie Antoinette to add to our Who Was books. We've got um, A Prairie Lotus by Linda Sue Park. If you have enjoyed Little House on the Prairie, I bet you will like this one. The box on the floor today. So, because um, I'm using the cart for something else, it's a little harder to get the books out. Um, we've got this one, Resistance by Jennifer A. Nielsen, um, which looks like a historical fiction about World War II. Oh, yep, Jewish resistance in Poland. Uh, global Baby, so cute for this. Love babies. Um, show me a sign. If you can see that, um, this is a book um, by a deaf writer about the deaf experience, um, and it looks like it's in Martha's Vineyard. So that's probably pretty cool. All right. What else have we got here? Looks like we've got some picture books and nonfiction coming up. So we've got Fairy House Crafts, Wonderful Whimsical Projects for You and Your Fairy House um, by Lisa Gardner Walsh. She's like a fairy house expert here in Maine. Um, I love her books. And, uh, you know, the summer reading theme is Imagine Your Story. And we just released a video about fairy houses not that long ago. Um, you should take a look at it. I hear a fairy named Dewberry Butterfly makes an appearance. I think she's pretty cool. Uh, this is the Upside Down Boy, um, El Nino de Cabreza. So, it'll be interesting one to look at. Oh, look at this one. A unicorn named Sparkle, and the cover is Sparkly by Amy Young. Uh, Uni the Unicorn and the Dream Come True by Amy uh, Cross Rosenthal and illustrated by Brigitte Berger. Oh yeah. Uh, the Three Ninja Pigs by Corey Rosen Schwartz, illustrated by Dan Santat. Uh, Auntie Luce's Talking Paintings. Ooh, that one looks pretty. I think this one takes place in Haiti. It's always fun to learn about another country. Emily Wrights, Emily Dickinson and Her Poetic Beginnings by Jane Yolen. Um, I love Jane Yolen and I love Emily Dickinson. Uh, I took a class with Emily Dickinson at college, so exciting. Uh, what else do we here. I have a small box today. There were some YA books in there, so I gave those to Cassandra before I get the rest of these out. Okay, so we've got Who's in the Garden. Uh, this is a barefoot book, and uh, they've got really good kind of door book type books. Uh, Crawdad Creek by Scott Russell Sanders, illustrated by Robert Hines. Uh, this is um, our adult uh, reference and technology librarian Ray's favorite author. Um, so I thought I'd get some of his books. And that's a really pretty illustration of a crawdad there. Uh, another one by Jane Yolen. Not all princesses dress in pink. Um, since we're having an imaginary story summer, I thought I would get a few more. 
magical books. Uh, Beastly Bionics, Red Robots, Brilliant Mimic Biomimicry, and Incredible Inventions Inspired by Nature. This is a new National Geographic one. And I think that looks pretty awesome. Uh, another Scott Russell Sanders. This one's called Meeting Trees. And it's about learning how to name different trees based on bark and leaves. And then lastly, we have Rapunzel, written and illustrated by Paul Ozelinski. And this is a Caldecott medal winner. This is a replacement um, for a beater, beaten, battered copy of the book that we had here. Um, so that's it for today's unboxing. It's a little bit of a small one, I know, but um, small but good. And I bet we've got other boxes coming. So with that, um, I will let you guys go. And these books should be available for you to request and check out soon. And I hope you are doing well. Take care. Bye.